Oh, do time for another beer review. This one we're off back to Buxton to another one of the new ones, which is in Asda. This is called Mantle. It is a Simcoe Sabro IPA. So two hop varieties that I can get on board with. It is 5.4% and 440 mil can. It says a juicy and refreshing IPA using hop favourites Simcoe and Sabro. So I've done the magic rock. But yeah, I thought that was decent. I've did the Siren Squiggle and I've done the new one from North, Constellations. They're all in my Asda playlist. So far, the best beer of the new ones that's in Asda for me is North's Constellations. Um, they were all all right. Um, I, was, I wasn't blown away with the um, Siren one, but... I could drink it again. It certainly wasn't a horrible drink, but it, it was solid. So we'll see where uh, where this one comes out with. And then I'm going to take a break from Asda because if I just drink supermarket beers, I'll get a little bit bored, you know. So here's a golden colour. Got a very um, brilliant white head. I uh, can't see any bubbles going up to it. Let's get the nose. Tangerines in abundance. Slight passion fruit in that. Yeah. It's kind of like tinned oranges. Yeah. That, that'll be the sub bro. Right. Let's dive in. Cheers, everybody. That's quite nice. Um, yeah, I'm getting orange, very slight hint of coconut and lime. So on the flavours, kind of what I would kind of get with a sabro. There's a very, very slight pine flavour coming out um, right on the back end. But up front, really, really juicy. Low, low bitterness. Um, quite a dry aftertaste as well. But not, but it's still pleasant. Sometimes I find dry beer is um, a little bit off-putting. But no, I'm quite cool with this one. The initial fruit burst. So I'm probably picking up that, that tangerine orange Satsuma thing up front first. It does fade out quite rapidly. Um, and then I say this little pine, pine bitterness comes in. The coconut is slight. The lime, slight. But, yeah, it's good. Um, it's a bit like a lot of the supermarket beers. Um, it doesn't have uh, the big, massive oomph in the, in the pronounced flavour profile. But, for what I paid, um, well, what my brother paid, he, he, we done a beer swap. Uh, it, it, won't be, it won't be expensive. So, um, for the price, not a bad one. It's another fairly decent one that's in the supermarket. As I said on the early ones, as they for me are on the upwards trend. They're not yet to um, to, to like say to Tesco's level, but they are price wise. They're coming in probably the cheapest out of like Tesco, Morrison's, as the Sainsburys. So um, out of the big ones, excluding the the discount ones like your Lidl and Aldi, um, if you are on a budget you know, then the probably, it's maybe not a bad, it's not a bad supermarket to go to because it is, like I say, it is improving. So, um, yeah, not bad. It is, it's fairly decent. Um, could I drink it again? Yeah. Um, so for the, and for the price, it wasn't bad. So, yeah, we've, we've taken all that into account. I probably would, I probably would recommend that one. I'm certainly preferring it more than I did Siren Squiggle. So, yeah, I probably, uh, I think the Constellations in this are probably the best too. I probably still lean for Constellations as the, as the better of the beers. That isn't, that isn't as the, sorry, but um, certainly not a bad one. So that is Mantle, Simcoe Sabro IPA. I'll add that to my, as the playlist. So thanks for watching and, on to the next one. Cheers.